We are back with more Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trials and Tribulations. We are here. It is the bridge to the turnabout. Tensions are at an absolute max. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Wait, I have to actually go. Let's go. Let's go. Five locks. Five trick locks. She's the one who put them there. Miles, so... Yeah, she's not gonna... Oh. There was only one lock last time we came here. Get some air miles. I'm perfectly fine. Whip. Miles gets whipped. Oh, Francisca's being nice, and also being mean. She's she's being mean, nice. She's being this. She's being the scolding mom friend that Miles needs in this moment. Poor Miles. You're very prideful, Francisca. You know that, right? Like, like, are you aware of your dynamics vis-a-vis -vis pride? Okay. All right, let's talk to Iris. How did you escape? Mm-hmm. Right. Well, that's that's what they always say when they get caught. I was running away for a totally legitimate reason and not at all to escape the law. Someone. I think I know who, Iris. I think we all we all basically know who. Don't tell me about the trick lock. There are hundreds of ways to Oh So it's not like it's not like fingerprint lock or anything where you, you literally need the person. It's just it's a puzzle and if you set it up then you know the combination but it okay. Why are we doing full names? Why is Phoenix doing full names? Francisca's thing is that she does full names. Now there are five. It means that someone added four. Hmm. Fair point. Well, why don't you go ahead and do that? That way we'll be 20% of the way done. Bolt cutters? Like, how heavy are those chains? Okay, that would take a while. That would take a long time. Yeah, that would take a, a, a decent amount of time. About a day. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it's better than doing nothing. You know what else is better than doing nothing? Bolt cutters. A blowtorch. A car. Get a car. Still one thing I don't quite get. told us you were in your room at Hazakura Temple, but you were seen at the Inner Temple. 
If only there was another character who you know who looks like this person. It's as if you were two people. Cyclock. Bum 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 bum. Triple barrel cyclock. Sigh. All right. I'd be nervous too. Hi, Miles. You're awful glary. I can see your eye through your hair. It's impressive. Did he just run off? I doubt that we're going to be laughing. Oh, Oh, poor Phoenix. He wanted to give Edgy a hug. Mm-hmm. You were reminded of something. Well, tell me about this something. Yep, that's what we think. Yep, Mia Fey wrote Maya when she was being murdered. That's what Mia Fey does when she's being murdered. She has a pattern of this, after all. It is her M.O. Perhaps her M.C., her Mortis Corpse Arandi? It's quite loud on my end. Was, didn't narrate it that much of a, of a rim shot, but okay. <laughs> everyone as a suspect. No, we don't! Maya has been locked in a room this whole time! Here, I'm gonna talk about earthquakes to traumatize you as punishment for suggesting that Maya might have killed someone. Again. Uh, suggesting again that Maya might have killed someone. I don't think I got it. There was an earthquake murder. I mean, if an earthquake directly led to the death of your father and you believing yourself responsible for it, then yeah. Yeah. Think I don't know that? I was there! He was, in fact, there, Phoenix. Yeah, Miles still doesn't like earthquakes. Aww. Aww. Say that! Say that! Say it, damn it, Phoenix. file there. You'd seen her face. Hey, Edgy figured it out. Phoenix, don't you? You came up here because you saw her face and you were reminded of the same person. A person who you know has a history of getting in legal trouble because she tried to frame you for murder. Why are you playing dumb? Why are you being dumb? So Edgeworth can't tell Phoenix about the person that Phoenix knows it is. Phoenix, drop the name. Say Dahlia Hawthorne. Say Dahlia Hawthorne. 
You should know this about... Woman is completely unrelated. You know what? I doubt that. I doubt that severely. You say that with complete confidence. You're wrong. You're absolutely wrong. You're 100% wrong. Tell him about Dahlia Hawthorne. Okay, so how do I do... The game wants me to tell him about the connection. Do I present Iris? I guess I present Iris's profile. Unless I have Dahlia's profile. Nope, don't. All right, fine. Where's Iris? Still don't know much about her past. Well... Mm-hmm. I should ask him what he's found. I just did! I just did! You don't care about the magazine article. We're the defense on this case! You defended my client! We're co-counsel! You fucking idiot! Do you think you- Yeah! You're, f you're my fucking co-counsel, you goddamn moron! You got- I'm a prosecutor and you're a defense attorney. We can't possibly be talking- You fucking idiot. You fucking idiot. Let's go to the gate and find the plot, I guess? Count on Iris to break those locks. Sure. From Sister Bikini, Edgeworth, Gumshoe, and Pearl. Okay. None of those people are here. So let's go somewhere else. Mm-hmm. Guess I should go check out the shack just down the... Okay, so the game is the game is very pointedly like it is grabbing the player by the shoulders and shoving them in the direction of the heavenly hall. I will allow myself to be shoved. Hi Pearl. Didn't expect to find you here, but you know, at least somebody in this scene is happy that you are. No, she's not dead. Well, She's not all right. She might be dead. I meant to say all right, but now that I've said dead, she might be dead. Do you know what dead means? Because you don't know what ticket means. And, well, oh, hi, Larry. Well, I'm, I look, you and Pearl fit in just fine at the loser shack because, oh, boy. Mr. Loris did a picture. Cooking some half-rotten potatoes over a miserable little campfire like losers. Oh, you poor losers. That's because you're a liar. Well, Pearl already knows that she can't trust Phoenix right. Listen, let me talk to you about your sketch. It's very good. I don't care what Francisca said. It's quite good. Two losers cooking potatoes together forevermore. You know what, Larry? Goals. Now, granted, I, I, I don't want to spend the rest of my life cooking potatoes with an annoying nine-year-old child, but two losers cooking potatoes forevermore? Goals. supposed to present that photo to Edgeworth? Hmm. 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 She really flew. I rather doubt that. I mean, I'm sure you saw it, but I'm also sure there's another explanation.
I mean, it's not a great... Whatever. Pearl, did you murder someone? Pearl, are you a murderer? Pearl, do you know what murder means? Oh my god. She's playing the I'm just a kid card. Pearl did it. Pearl's the fucking murderer. Pearl's the fucking murderer. Oh my god. Pearl's the fucking murderer. Yes! Yes! Pearl's the fucking murderer! Pearl's probably not the fucking murderer, but oh my god, you guys. What if Pearl was the fucking murderer? What if Pearl was the fucking murderer, sports pun? What if Pearl was the fucking murderer? You were supposed to be in her room reading a book with her, but she wound up dead. How did that happen, little girl? <laughs> tell me, tell me, tell me you killed her. Tell me you killed her. Tell me you killed her. And then tell a judge that you killed her. Oh, she has a Cyclock. Oh, she has a quintuple Cyclock. <laughs> your spiritual power has disappeared because you're a murderer. You're a murderer. Wait a second, you can't channel Mia? Or do anything else you might have wanted to do? But, you know, mostly channel Mia. Let's be honest here. Like Larry. No, wait, Larry's good. Larry's good. Look, Larry painted that very realistic portrait of Sister Iris. Hey, Miles, what do you make of this piece of filth? This is what he saw. Every single time I see that man, he is up to here. Up to here, I say, in garbage. Okay, so we've established that Edgeworth is still mad at Larry. Well, that's great. That doesn't prove the connection between Iris and Dahlia Hawthorne that, honestly, Phoenix should just know. But, you know, whatever. Hi, Bikini. You seem, um... Not terribly happy. Uh, a lot and bad. Also, there were like five locks. Okay. Iris. So the only people who know how to set the locks are people versed in Korean tradition, which... Doesn't rule out Pearl. Could be Pearl. You were telling me how the Master of Kurain disappeared 17 years ago. How did Misty Fay come back and wind up dead? Uh, after she showed me the talisman that proved she was a master, she said... Someone is trying to... I mean, yes, we know this. We know this. Morgan Fay is here, back from the dead, or at least back from the prison. Isn't it time to... This is a good time to call up the prison and say, Hey, Morgan Fay's still locked up, right? Escaped, you say? To shreds, you say? child becomes the new master of Karain, her daughter's the main family, all other means, yep. That, 
it does seem like the kind of arrangement that is, you know, rife with politicking and assassination. Tell me more about the green channeling technique. I've seen its uh, power many times. Mm -hmm. Usually her sister, yeah. It is, to be fair, usually her dead sister. During the mask, pfft, Damask case. All the power and influence, you're not rich. Well, I mean, they do have this fancy temple all to themselves. All because of one little mist. Phoenix. Phoenix, you know. DL6, Phoenix. Yes. DL6. DL6. Tell me about DL6. So it's like the game, I don't know, here's the thing, the game was like teasing this DL6 thing all through Ace Attorney, and then we didn't really see any of it in Justice for All, and then we get to Trials and Tribulations and they're like, oh shit, we better pay that off. DL6 is the White Hummer of Phoenix Wright cases. That one sports one might not even get, but it fits. Murder took place 17 years ago. Mm -hmm. Channel the spirit, learn the identity of the killer, the medium to perform the channeling was Misty Bay. They charged the wrong guy. Case remained a mystery. And then she dis she disapparated. Ray. She does in fact mean Maya, or perhaps Master Morgan. Dun dun dun. You work for Morgan Fay. It hasn't come up until now that only the women inherit the power, but maybe it's coming up now. Maya did have a sister, and she wound up dead. Faye had an elder sister. Did I know that Morgan was Misty's sister? Probably. Probably would have pieced it together if I figured it out, because I did know that Morgan is Maya's aunt. So, yeah. Yeah.
And we're doing a plot recap for people who didn't play Justice for All. One more time. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, what? I. What? Iris is Morgan's daughter? I can't. <laughs> Phoenix has the correct answer here. Iris is what? What? <laughs> what? She's what? <laughs> She's what? <laughs> she... No! I thought she was Dahlia Hawthorne! Or Dahlia Hawthorne's identical twin! Pearl never told me she had a sister?! Pearl... <laughs> How did we not... How is... <laughs> Does Pearl not know? Wait. Wait. Maybe. Wait, Pearl has to know. Pearl has a side clock. What? Okay, so we didn't meet... We didn't meet Iris when we went to Kurain in the last game because Iris was here. Why has Pearl never mentioned that she... Pearl has to know that she has a sister. Unless Pearl found out off-screen in this case, which is not the kind of thing that this game would do if it was well-written, which, eh. What? Bikini, you're very bad at this. Yeah, she is in prison. Yeah, she was found to be a co-conspirator in a murder. Yeah, she wanted Pearl to be the new master, not Iris. I wonder why. Hmm. Morgan had... Up until 45 seconds ago, I thought Morgan had one. And then I went Morgan had... She had three? Okay, this is new information for the... Her twin sister. So, so I was right that Iris has a twin sister and that twin sister is Dahlia Hawthorne. But I was not aware that she's also Morgan Faye's daughter. Well, shit! Twin sister. Twin sister. Okay. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. Ooh. Ooh. Yep, that's a that's angry Morgan. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's a bad thing. That's not a good thing for a person to do. He was a jeweler, you know. Okay. To be looked after by us here. And that girl was Iris. Iris has... Okay. What was the name of Iris's sister? J just say it. Could I jog your memory? Phoenix, ask her. Ask her, was it by any chance 
Dahlia. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, for fuck's sake. Mm-hmm. Oh, Phoenix, she was very angry! able to break free of the bars that uh-huh ask more questions get more info okay all right let's present shit i don't know iris has a twin sister or perhaps had. Jeweler father. So Phoenix isn't telling Bikini who her who he thinks Iris's twin sister is to spare her something. Okay. All right. God, this game became a soap opera when I wasn't looking. There's still got to be a murder trial at the end of this somehow. Hi, Dick. Hey, Dick, guess what I just found out? Who cares if the clues I find are no good? Okay. <laughs> Is this to reggae? I, no. No, I don't want to imagine Dick Gumshoe sing. No. Cause every little case is gonna be airtight. <laughs> Cause every little case is gonna be airtight. <laughs> Oh, God. I just got here. Two seconds ago. I didn't hear anything. No clues. These weird scraps of paper. Okay. Get, tell me about that. Let's talk about the letter, Dick. Okay. As soon as you something something, you must channel her spirit, leave everything up to her. Nicholas Richard Fuckface Gumshoe! Just from the thumbnail of the text of one page of the letter, I can tell that it's related to the case. You fucking idiot. You moron. You boob. You incompetent fuckwit. Unrelated to them. It was in the incinerator. It was in the incinerator. The MacGuffin is always in the incinerator. Oh, he's going to have to pay. He is going to have to pay the department for permission to still be on this case. Unbelievable. Inconceivable. You know what, T-Flower? For, I think it's 250 but it might be 500 Goog Bucks. I would say that. Won't say it for free. But for a pittance of Goog Bucks. I just, I very well might. Hey, 
just from the... It's all spirit. It's got no relation to the... It's got no relation to the case. You fucking idiot. You fucking idiot. Jeebus42 has redeemed 250 Goog Bucks. He would like me to do something. And I will say this, not to you, Jeebus. I have said it to you before, and you may deserve it again in the future. But Richard Alexander Chicago-style deep dish pizza gumshoe, you are a bush tit. God. God, I better give it a good looking over and some serious chuck it in the trash when you're done you are the worst cop the worst cop there's three pages of this as soon as you hear the lights out bell the lights out bell the thing that's these are direct instructions to someone who is right here and you write it off as worst cop you're the worst cop consider okay sorted by competence you are the worst cop you are the worst cop her name is blank she is our blank the whole blank here is a picture of her use it when you channel her I know you can do it once this is done, burn the something. Don't tell anyone about the letter. Gravely roast the master in the fires of Hades and bring our vengeance to fruition. And you think this is... I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna wring his neck. I'm gonna wring his neck. I'm gonna reach into the video game. I'm gonna... Okay, so, Pearl channeled somebody, and that somebody killed Misty, and now Pearl's upset about it, and based on historic precedent, Pearl is a murderer. Based on, based on a trial that we've already had, Pearl is a murderer, because Pearl channeled someone that killed Misty! Pearl did it! Or perhaps Iris did it! Or perhaps Dahlia did it! One of them did it! They all fucking did it. They worked together in perfect harmony to channel this dead person who killed Misty Faye in a fit of rage. I can't up. Gumshoe is the worst cop. The actual worst cop. The worst. Co Tell me about your investigation, dick. Yes, you should. Yep, yep, the, the murder took place there. Okay. Okay. So Misty was channeling Mia. No, Misty just pulled a Mia. It's a Faye thing. It's a these sis, it's a this family thing. Maya, Mia learned from her mom. They must have had a girl talk at some point after Maya was born. And M Misty said to Mia, now Mia, this is very important. If you're ever being murdered, I need you to write your sister's name in your own blood. That will somehow lead to them catching your killer. I'll do the same thing if I'm ever being murdered. Also, Jeebus. That was funny. If you don't find Maya dead, we're gonna be faced with an ugly situation. She's gonna be dead, Phoenix. Yeah, Godot's not happy. Oh, for I forgot that Godot is involved here. Godot's not. Wait, no. Math, thinking, hold on. Can't be. Never mind. Murder weapon. Yeah, we, we figured that.
must have been another blade. And that's what you're looking for. I'm no chicken. We've got the feather of forensics. <laughs> okay. Did you bring back that dog? Did you bring back the dog? Tell me you brought back the dog. You're bringing back everything else. We're bringing back the Faye family drama. We're bringing back the DL6 incident. Tell me you brought back the dog. Where's Missile? The murder weapon was a sword. Swords are... Fair enough. You brought back the metal detector. You brought back the metal detector. A metal detector. And he's just going to hand it over. Sure. Let's detect some metal. Should I? Yes, you should help detect. Yes. We're going to play Forensics Expert Simulator. The hot new game coming to Steam. Sift through crime scenes. Yeah, Gumshoe uses this thing for hours, finds nothing. We're going to find the murder weapon in... Uh, set the over-under at 90 seconds. It's possible the real murder weapon is around here somewhere. So first, let's turn the detector on. Mm -hmm. Move the detector around, give the courtyard a good look-see. Okay, so it's just like the signal finder in Juan Carita's hotel room. Pick some metallic objects that are hidden from sight. Take a good look at anything and everything that seems suspicious. Fair enough. That's a ladder. It's made out of metal. Yeah, fuck it. They're doing the ladder scene! They're doing the ladder scene! Yay! That's cap. Nope, they're, they're completely different. Okay, fair, fair enough. Anyway, what's uh, what's this thing? Yeah, but what's the blue thing? Mm-hmm. Okay. I mean, you'd probably be better at whatever job you have. Because, again, sorted by competence, you are the worst cop. <laughs> he, he still wants to be a cop. Fair enough. Hey, was she murdered with her own stick? Okay, the, the game just shorted out, so... Well, not shorted out, but... I, I noticed that it has changed, so... Yeah, but the detector says it's made out of metal. Richard! Oh my god. I, 90 seconds. T take the under, kids. We just fucking found it. Because he didn't even look at it. Because it looked like it was made out of wood. Sorted by competence, you are the worst cop. Sorted by competence, you are the worst cop. The worst cop. The worst fucking cop. Shut up, dick. The top's coming off. It spins. It's it's not a cane. It's a weapon sheath. It's a sword. Good work, dick. You missed a sword. We found a sword and a staff. We're the fucking king of England, and you're the worst goddamn cop! Yes, I did just hit two sound effects at once, only one of which I intended to hit. Now I'm gonna hit two sound effects at once, both of which I intend to hit. God damn it, Richard! It's a fucking sword. 
the fucking sword. Jeebus with the ah ha 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 ha. Tell me about the fucking sword that I just found because you're too fucking stupid to do your fucking job when given a tool with which to do your fucking job, you tool. <sighs> you even know what a sword cane is. You are aware of the... You are aware of the concept of the sword cane. Thank goodness it wasn't a cane sword. Okay, that's funny. Wait, wait, wait. So if the murder weapon can't be anywhere else in the scene, we take one look at the, the hooked object in our hands and say, It's gotta be! It's gotta be in the cane! Oh, God. I amuse me. Why was the sword used to kill the victim found in the main hall courtyard? Because they dragged it here. No one. Until you discovered it? Until you discovered it? Okay, let's go with that. It was wiped clean. Maybe it was wiped clean. There you go. This thing's definitely the murder one. Oh, good work, Dick. Good work, Dick. There's gotta be some tr traces of blood. Yeah, there's probably also fingerprints. You know, Phoenix Wright's fingerprints. He Cause every little case. It's gonna be airtight. Wait, no. The fingerprints are never of the actual murderer. That's probably true. Oh, no. Wait. Were those my, those can't have been Maya's instructions? Oh no! Oh no! No, it's a tease. It's a tease. She's fine. She might be a little, you know, scared and traumatized or something, but she's fine. Just a regular run-of-the-mill staff. Okay. Why are we hiding evidence? It's a place at the base of the mountain that has really good pasta. Probably to defend herself against people who wanted to murder her because she's Misty Fay and she's the master of the Korean channeling technique and she has many enemies, Phoenix. You just learned all of that five minutes ago. You dummy. 